celebrating this day like a birthday. So it's also later. But don't wait to jump in too long. Don't sleep, you gotta stay up. Don't so sleep, you gotta stay up. Oh! Hey y'all, so I'm recording this a couple of days before my birthday. My birthday is like in the, what day is today? Two more days. So happy birthday to me and to all of you fellow tourists out there. To those who already had their birthday and to those who have not had their birthday yet. I know I run into a lot of tourists all the time. Like when I'm doing personal readings, like I do a lot of personal readings for a lot of fellow tourists. So, and um, so I guess we're just drawn to each other because I follow a lot of people here on YouTube, and then I found out that they're tourists also. So, happy birthday, everyone! So, this is what I want to talk about. Did I say peace on earth and love and light to you? No. So, peace on earth and love and light to you. This was the day 36 years ago. I just went over that big old hump that I always have to go to when I want to get back to my mama's house. 36 years ago, of course, I was born on this day, May 5th, 5 5. So, when I first started getting into this stuff, like I always loved the number 5 because I was born on 5 5. So, I just like, I see it all the time and like I always felt like okay like um, when I learned about life paths I was like I gotta be a life path five because like um, I just see fives everywhere my birthday is five five so I thought I was a life path five added it up and I am not I am a life path three so <laughs> and the thing is I know that I am a life path three like uh, a lot of things about a three life path resonate with me and a lot of things about a five life path resonates with me also so like at first when i was just listening to it i could have sworn i was a five but i'm not a three so i do think like i think my destiny number though like my destiny number is a five so um we go over here to mcdonald's so what boo I think it's my destiny number, expression number. It's one of those that's actually a five. And it sounds so much like me. But anyways, like, I'm just thinking about how not just my birthday, but everybody's birthday. This is why, this is a reason to celebrate your birthday. Because this is the day that your creator said, I am going to make a um little... Let's take me for example, okay? This is the day that I make a little black girl. And I give her to um, this mother or whatever. People say we choose our parents or whatever. So I don't know how I feel about that. But I do feel like I am where I am at for a reason. So I feel like this is the day that he said, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put her into this womb on this day. And she's going to have these certain characteristics. And she's going to have these certain characteristics for a reason. Because, like, <laughs> I want her to go through a lot of um, things that she's going to need to be really strong for. Um, she's going to have to go through a lot of things that... Um, that I'm not gonna I know I'm gonna have to send a lot of people her way to where she's gonna going to have to really have this skin not take it personal and like uh, I want her to also show people like how to value themselves and how to know their worth better so you know what <laughs> That little girl looked over there. So I like that. I like her car. I think she was saying she liked my car. She was. She was saying she liked my car. So um, a little girl would like this green beetle. So, <laughs> but the thing is, so that day the creator said, okay, well then, 
let's make her a Taurus. You know, let's let's make her born on the fifth of May. Let's make her be born with another little girl. So they're not gonna be identical, because that's gonna be part of her struggle also. So let's put her into this lady's belly with another little girl. And let's actually make them a lot alike, but quite different. And let's let them be, let's, let's let her be born six minutes later than her at 6.42 a.m. And that will make her a double Taurus with a Libra moon. So, um, the things that I want her to go through is to, she has to learn how to, uh, stand on her own two feet. She has to learn how to be more, uh, <laughs> as much as I like being by myself, that's the tourist side of me. I don't like to go anywhere. I don't like to go places by myself, like go out. So one thing I have to learn. So I have to be able to stand up for people. And I have to be able to um, really resonate with people. I have to be the one that's going to take up for people and not just let people get just dragged under the bus. That was the calling I had on my life, so I have to be naturally born with some of those characteristics and actually learn how to perfect them. So that for, I was made a Taurus, a double Taurus, and a Libra moon. So once I learned that I was all those things and I was like, yeah, I am those things. So let me just see how to make that work for me and my calling. So, I feel like this day is very special because this is the day that Yahweh, your creator, put a special being into this world to actually help save it. Whatever your birthday is, this that was the day that your creator decided to put a special being into this world to save it. The world needs people that are going to stand up for people. The world needs people that are not going to just uh, sit back and just let people um, run all over them. They need The world needs people that's going to um, basically just not take any crap from people. And that's who I am. The world needs the opposite too. The world needs someone who is more sympathetic to people in their feelings, you know. So the world needs Geminis. So, you know, the world needs someone that's going to pop off at, a, at any minute to just really tell you, oh, no, I'm just not going to play that. Like, you ain't going to play that with me. You get one chance. You get one try. So the world needs Aries. So, you know, um, the world needs someone who is going to say, you know what, um, that was not quite right. Do it again until it gets better. The world needs Virgos. So, on your birthday, there is a special day. There was the day that your creator chose you to come into the world to save it to make it just a little bit better you're special look how special you are you and your characteristics everything in your birth chart makes you and makes you special makes you different from everyone else so it doesn't matter if no one else understands how different you are it doesn't matter only thing that matters is as long as you know how different you are because your difference matters it is your difference that's going to actually come in and make the one thing that someone couldn't fix fix you know celebrate your birthday it says that without you without this day without you being born on this day we would have been less one less a special person 
you know whatever you have contributed whether you have contributed anything at all you have because you're here right and even if you have not felt like you've helped anyone you will you will one day you will have contributed in some type of way and if you just feel like you haven't then um you will so <laughs> find, try to find somebody who you can so who you can help that's all you guys celebrate your birthday okay your special is special that is all bye continue to come and grow with me and subscribe